hi viewers welcome back today again come up with another video uh, this was this one is a Dusan compressor is not starting so I'm going to check it this one is my switch key start switch I just on it or I push so no response okay so here is it's a this code is coming C the C mean the communication failure of the ECM with the, the SEC unit. This one is our SECU unit. So now I will check the value of the terminator resistors and also check the harness between the ECM and the SECU unit. And this one is my this resistor. This is a my one terminator resistor is a, this side uh, this one is the ECM side okay so this one my, this one is my ECM and this is my resistor okay so this is my kin bus of uh, terminator resistor SECU unit side and uh, this resistor is my ECM side okay this is a cane bus so i'm going to check the resistor and also check the harness this code showing the communication problem communication failure of the ecm 120.5 ohm resistance is okay okay so i check this one is a terminator resistor so resistance 120 ohm is okay and also I checked in off camera other terminal resistor that one is also 120.5 ohms so it's mean that my resistor is okay so here you can see my all my four relays also here so one relay is a EGR relay one is ECM relay and one is a preheat relay and one is the engine starter relay so all my relays are here so I'm going to also check the uh, harness and also check the relays their connections are okay relays are working good or not so in off camera I will check all the connections okay this uh, relay so you can see this uh, too much dust and also too much uh, this uh, rusting is inside here and this wire this wire is going to here on the starter relay so this relay is coming here so I check also my using my multimeter so I check the, this wire uh, this relay this wire is coming to here so I going to clean it I will clean this one okay so after I will check it so this relay I removed you can see also this relay is too much rusted okay this uh, greenish powder is there so this relay is also I went to clean it and then after I fix it and then check okay so this is a maybe this one is a problem I'm not sure but first I clean it see I have cleaned this uh, relay properly okay so I clean it and also I clean the base uh, so this side also clean it with WD-40 so now I'm going to fix back this relay and we'll so this one is my preheat relay this one also I'm going to check this one so you can see my first relay was very dirty this leg has broken you can see this leg is broken so here you can see the condition of this relay is very bad so I am going to replace this relay this is a preheat relay I will replace this relay and also I have the clean the start relay and this relay I will change then after it I will try to fixing these two relays back then I will start try to start the compressor and also you can see I have fixed back this uh, start relay and also I change the preheat relay I'm going to start my compressor so here is a business is on okay so I'm going to start but still no start okay. 
so is in the uh, off camera i check all the harness from this uh, this one is my ecm this uh, ecm to this uh, this one se secu unit check the harness and also check the harness uh, uh, from this uh, release up to this ecm the or the harness is a good one continues okay okay check already but what is the problem this three this is a starter relay this one is a engine ecm relay and this one is a, our egr motor relay so this all three relays not getting the ground so this one our ground this all relays not getting the ground so these grounds coming to coming the ground to these relays from this ecm so now i have concluded maybe this ecm is malfunctioning it not the it not gives the ground to the relays this will give the ground connections so my relay will be activated so this time my relays are not activating and it's not giving the power to the starter okay also not going power to the egr and also not going power to this ecm back to from this relay this is a ecm relay when this get the ground okay so when we switch on this when we switch on this uh, machine so this give the ground to all these relays but here ground is not coming so i concluded that maybe this ecm have the problem so i will check an other ecm i fix it then i will decide it this one is my ecm engine control unit and this one is secu units okay which get the information so they give the information and give the code if any problem is coming my all test is okay harness is okay and my terminal resistor is also giving the good value and uh, also all other test continuity test voltage test i did all when off the camera so according to my control test control units i have brought from other machines okay so now i'm going to fix uh, in this compressor so this is a from came from the other machine okay this is written the number of the other machine and uh, these both i have brought from the other one so now i'm going to fix it here in the compressor this compressor and then we'll check as you can see i have just uh, fixed the grips not properly fix it okay so this uh, this uh, ecu is also i not just only i put the grip here not fix properly just i on fix and going to check and i'm going to on the switch switch on so here you can see so this is no c code is not coming so code is all codes are finished and by properly fix the icm is here you can see so now i'm going to start so this is the machine is on now you can see now going to start all code on the all code is coming all code is on now the pressure is working good one hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends